as this young man was standing here, I, I, I was thinking about, you know, when you, when, when, I, when, I, when an elder puts his arm around a young man, he affirms him and, 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 and you know, he wants to give him uh, the assurance that I've got your back. Okay. Uh, this man, uh, this young man needs to put his arm around some of us old men. Eh? <laughs> Amen. 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 He, knows, he knows what he believes. Yes, sir. Yes. And so, thank you for that encouragement. And thank you for, for, for sharing with us uh, with conviction. Oh, yeah. Yes. Uh, I'm not going to speak like the young man. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, because today I'm going to speak out of my heart. Yes, sir. Okay. And many other men doesn't know me. Hmm. So I'm going to give you my name, and I'm going to give you my surname. My name is Dion, and my surname is Kapal. So pass the emotion. Because you want to make my wife pray like Kapal. From the conference. You know, men, this weekend for me, it was very special. Oh, yeah. It was... Friday, before leaving PE to this place, I almost cancelled. I said to my wife, I don't know if I must fall down. I said to her, I'm feeling so broken. And I'm not ashamed to stay here. But because of all the messages that I received here, I went to a tough time. I went to such a difficult time. And a lot of people here know what I'm talking about. But I can say thank you, thank you to the Lord for letting me be here because why? Because of me being here, it strengthened me so much. Oh, yes. It oh, yeah. shown me all my faults, Amen. my shortcomings also, Amen. because we are not perfect as we Amen. And I'm sure there's men sitting here that feels exactly the same way as I'm feeling here today. Amen. But I'm strengthened up. Amen. I'm powered up. Amen. I was 6 volt, but I'm 24 volt. Yes, sir. The operator is charging more than 24 volt because I have electronics also on the bed. Amen. Amen. I know what I'm talking about. Amen. And you know, when I go back now, I know what it is to be a there. Yes, sir. Amen. Because the Lord has shown me the way. Man, I'm talking to you today. And I'm speaking to myself as well. We must not just come here. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. And then we go from here, we go and we just yes. talk about it on the way back home. Mm -hmm. And tomorrow when we start, we forget to talk about this thing in the workspace. Amen. Yeah. We heard about it, we have to speak it in the workspace. Oh, yeah. And the Lord has showed me now, I need to step up. Hey. Ah, yeah. Yeah. Because I've been sitting down too Yes, much. sir. Mm -hmm. You know, I was asking the question in the morning, why was I chosen this morning to open the prayer? When I myself need prayer, because I'm, uh, I'm still going through a healing process. But you know, it's only God that wipes down the bleeding from my body. Okay. It's only God that can heal each and every one because it says a lot of men sitting here this morning feeling the same way. But many a times we are too afraid to stand up and say this is how I feel. We are even afraid to say pray for me because See. the Lord wants to lift us up. Oh, yeah. But we need the prayers of those who love us. That's the reason why I'm appealing to you today. Amen. I was the leader of Jacksonville. A company status that was not even a company status. There was no company status for many years in Port Elizabeth District. The Lord has chosen me for that company status. To be the leader of that church. And it's not easy. Because Satan is always there. He's knocking at my door 24-7. Many times I'm down and out and I say, Lord, please help me. Yes, sir. If it wasn't for the wife that I have, with the work that she does, that she does every day, sitting with the meetings, sitting with the prayers, you will never realize that she's the one that coaches me every day. Amen. She's telling me, I just heard this in the sermons. I just heard this from the meetings. Let us pray together. Amen. We need the wives that can pray with us as husbands because many times we are weak, but the wife steps up. And that is what we need today. So today I'm thankful for everything that happened here. And, and, and I'm not taking anything for granted. I'm going back a much better person. Amen. I'm still a little bit in the healing process, just like Pastor said. It doesn't, it doesn't go quick. It takes time. 
But I know what the Lord wants from me. Because the Lord wants to push me in the higher It's myself that is keeping myself behind. Because the, 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 the opportunity is there. But many a times we step back. You know, sometimes we don't see what is inside a person. But God knows what is in the heart. And the, the Lord knows what we can do. But many a times we step back. On sales is not only a man. But the other is just right on. And I can clear for you. But then many times they say, Lord, I'm still beaten down. The Lord says, I have to be able to do it. But I'm not going to be able to do it. Let's pray for one another. Then as we leave this place, when we come back again next year, we must have a bigger tent in this, because this is not all the men yet. We need this thing to work. Even now with the group that we have, we need to work this thing properly, plan it properly, and make it better for next time. May the Lord bless you. Amen.